Question 24, it's the last question on the paper, so we'll expect it to be a bit harder, so it is going to be a level 5 question. It says, in a class, 18 of the children are girls, a quarter of the children are boys, and we've got to figure out all together how many children in the class. Remember, all together is just a posh word for the total. Now, the easiest way to do this one is to think about fractions in pizzas. So, if I draw a pizza, or a circle, I'm not really drawing a pizza, if I draw a circle to represent the whole class and split it into quarters, let's think about what we can fill in here. A quarter of the children are boys. So, one quarter must be boys, B for boys. Now, if you think about it, if a quarter is boys, the rest of the class, which is three quarters, must be girls. It doesn't say that, but it must be. So, the rest of the class must be girls. So, G, G, G. So, we've got one quarter boys, three quarters girls. Now, let's look at what we can do. 18 of the children are girls. So, these three quarters must be 18 altogether. Now we've got three sections to split 18 across. If you split 18 across three equal sections, 18 divided by 3 is 6. So that must mean each of these sections for girls is worth 6. So that's 6, 6, and 6 again. So each quarter is worth 6. Now hang on a minute, all quarters must be the same size. So if each quarter is worth 6, that means the boys' quarter must also be worth six. And now we've accounted for the whole class. So now we're in a position to work out how many children we've got all together in this class. So we've got four quarters. Every quarter is worth six. So all together we've got four lots of six. And four lots of six is 24 children. And that's it. I'm hoping you can see how drawing our pizza there and thinking about the fractions and writing things onto each pizza slice can help us work out the total amount of children in the class.